Kenya. Welcome back to Kenya's Decor Corner. So today we are in my entryway and as you can see it's still decorated for Christmas. So it is chilly out today but spring is on the way so we need to take down this Christmas decor and brighten and lighten up this space for springtime. So if you guys want to see how I transform my entryway from Christmas to spring then just keep watching. Okay guys, so as you can see, I have a lot of Christmas decor up, so we have a lot of work to do. So let's go ahead and get started.
Okay guys, so now that everything is cleaned up and the floor is dry, I have moved in my extra chair here that I usually have there except at Christmas time. So I've replaced that and as you can see, I've added this pillow to one of the chairs. And so I'm gonna add this one to the other one and we will fill in with all the decor. So I will not continue talking. I'll just show you guys how I put this space together. Okay guys, and here is my final look. I decided to add a white throw blanket on this pillow and well, behind the pillow and you know, over the chair uh, right there. And here is our entryway table. And I think it looks really, really cute. I love it actually. <laughs> and this one over here, I decided not to add a, a throw because we have the florals here in the corner. So I think that's enough accent over there. And I did also decide to add in some greenery at the bottom of the sticks, just to fill it in a bit. And yeah, I think it looks really, really, really Cute, welcoming. So this is what my guests will see when they first enter our home. And with this welcome sign, it says, welcome to our nest. I did like the sign a whole lot, but I did not like the cotton balls on the end. And so as you can see, I just put a lantern there with a candle and a garden ball on top to cover that so you can't see it. So I think that was a nice, easy fix and it still looks very nice. And on the bottom shelf, I just have a galvanized watering can filled with some flowers and greenery. And this is our little melt warmer in the background there, so I like to keep that there um, because I like to, you know, add fragrance as you enter our home. And I added these little ducks here with some greenery just to fill in that space. And I'm really, really happy with how things turned out. And that is our entryway. I'm really happy with it. So I have this half of the entryway done, but I will pan around so you guys can see I did not do anything over here just yet 
and I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do there but I may just go ahead and add something just to complete the look so it's not completely bare but or I may just wait and leave it as is and come back and show you guys how I decorate that portion as well as the um, portion of the entryway that's behind me so yeah so this is my entryway table and I'm really happy with how it turned out. This is a very inviting spring look. So as you guys can see, I'm doing neutrals this year for spring. Uh, leave me comments down below to let me know if you're using color or if you're going neutral this year or what's your preference. I'll be interested in seeing and knowing what you guys are doing for spring this year. This is a different look for me, and I have to say, I really, really like it. It's kind of like garden. It's giving me garden farmhouse vibes. <laughs> so yeah, that is my entryway. Okay guys, so I hope that y'all have enjoyed this video, and if so, please be sure to go ahead and give it a thumbs up. That helps me out tremendously. Also, if you are new here, welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope that you will, you have enjoyed this video enough to go ahead and click the subscribe button. And also be sure to hit the notification bell to receive alerts as to when I upload new videos. And also leave me comments down below guys to let me know what you think about this refresh. I really am loving it actually. And also I want to remind you guys to be sure to come back for part two of this video because I will be decorating the portion behind the door that I didn't get to today and also the other half of our entryway where the cross wall is. So I will do that, both those areas in part two of the video. So be sure to stop back by and also have your notification on so that you won't miss any videos so you don't miss that one either. Alrighty guys, for my faithful family members, you guys know I love you, love you, love you so, so, so very much. And I look forward to seeing all of you on the next video. Much love and many blessings. Bye-bye.